you think about your sexual orientation, why do you think that someone has a different sexual orientation than you if they're attracted to all the same people or roughly the same people that you are, but they have a different sort of body than you do? It's not clear to me why we should think that you have a different sexual orientation than that person, other than artifacts of social prejudice against people for being attracted, having certain sorts of attractions with certain sorts of bodies. So what I propose is that instead of thinking of it that way, we should think of it one directionally. Who are you attracted to? And then categorize your sexual orientation in terms of who you are attracted to. And not only that, but then one other thing. Rather than just who you are attracted to in terms of their body, think not only of their body, but also take into account gender expression and identity. That one of the important things about who we're attracted to is not just what's under their clothes, but it's also how they move through the world. And thinking about both of those things as equally important when just talking about our sexual orientations. There's another, I think, very important upshot of this, which is that sexual orientation doesn't, although it can be, it certainly does not need to, and there's pressure against it being binary. So if we're defining your sexual orientation in terms of the sexes and genders of persons that you're attracted to, there's no reason to think, unlike with terms like gay and straight, that there's going to be only two options for you there. We can, depending on how many genders are recognized, depending on how many sexes are recognized, there's going to be a plethora of options rather than only two. So suppose that um, we took into account both male and female bodies and intersex bodies. And then suppose we took into account um, androgynous people along with more feminine and more masculine people. That would automatically give you way more options than if the options are only like male and female bodies, which is currently the, the only kind of options people have.